I think it's obvious to the um, alternative research community, and that is this UFO disclosure phenomena that we seem to be always playing this cat and mouse game since for decades now. Ever since the Roswell incident, it seems that orbs or shiny silver balls flying at thousands and thousands of miles per hour that defy physics that we understand and disappear and reappear presenting a type of physics that we are not aware of or it's an unknown origin and this has been going on for years for the longest time however it seems today the attitude towards UFOs at least in what I've seen is more accepting more inevitable billionaires coming out admitting that aliens exist and they're investing a lot of money into the research uh, some uh, some CERN research if you are not a, um, aware of CERN hit the collider in Europe that is investigating the the origins of the universe God particle and all that if you if you haven't researched that go ahead and do it but the alternative research towards the CERN machine is that it is messing with interdimensional physics and in that they have allegedly discovered beings in these other multiverses or dimensions or whatnot but it seems as if soft disclosure is currently happening right before our eyes and it's just so interesting how when for example the movie with Matt Damon and uh, when his, his uh, movie when he went to Mars I can't recall it off the top of my head isn't it interesting that the day it is released NASA makes this huge announcement about Mars that it has water or ice or something to that I, I don't recall but I remember that it did happen they did make that announcement the same day and I thought man this is so someone's this is either a clever marketing for the movie or people are trying to program society to think a certain way both are very plausible um, both maybe both are true who knows but it seems that the one thing that it's uncanny about all this soft disclosure and the UFOs is that society seems to be swaying towards aliens or UFOs to be benevolent or they will be some sort of savior because they have technology and they reached us and we couldn't reach them so we should listen to whatever they say blah 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 and for the exception of very few the majority of of uh, people who are supporting the alien contact or whatever you want to call it seems to be hey man you're benevolent we're cool we'll listen to you that just seems the the way i feel the the, uh, the research and the information i've gone over and i don't think that's the right approach i really don't i think we should look at it as uh, how do we know these entities and i do believe disclosure will happen i think that's going to be the game changer i think that is what is going to introduce the possibility of having a one world government a big deceptive opportunity for someone who has malintent and i do believe the possibility of aliens being malicious i do believe that because of the biblical perspective if you look at the bible you have entities you have entities that rebel and are against humanity these entities in context can be categorized as aliens and so given that perspective aliens um, or extra dimensional uh, beings in my opinion will appear to deceive the world and although that sounds far-fetched it's pretty much the same idea that aliens will come extraterrestrial aliens will come in their ships to to provide 
the answers to humanity and save us. It's the same perspective, but just the opposite. Uh, it's the opposite. Uh, uh, so it's a, it's it's pol the polarity is different. It's one it's one from one perspective to another, and if you're going to entertain one side, you got to entertain the other. That's what I think. Disclosure: UFOs and all has been a big topic for the last several years, but especially this year, it seems to be more. Um, it's been hot. It's been uh, in the news. It's come out in 60 Minutes with billionaires like Bigelow admitting that aliens are real. Fox News reporting on on this idea. And it just seems to be almost perfect timing considering the the world and how it is and the instability.